Hey guys, real quick, go to the link in our description down the bottom and join our Discord. That's where we're going to be taking all our requests for videos in the future. Join the Discord, that way you can put your requests there and we'll be happy to uh, oblige. All of our unfiltered discussions are there as well as awesome people who are excited to engage with you. So go ahead, click the link in the description and we will see you there. Subscribe. Some people don't know that helps us. Black woman warns Jason Aldean and white folks. Folks. Can't wait to hear what this person has to say. The best part about this is I can tolerate it here because it's the Hodge twins that's gonna blow it way over the top and start talking about sharks and ditches and stuff. <laughs> it's just another one of those people that think they're the only one who is right and is going to find everything they can possibly dig up to try to make a point that will fail, inevitably. Fail, it always does. Because frankly, Jason Aldean didn't really do anything wrong. He made a music video. Ooh. He said, you know, the old F around and find out in a small town. That's really all he was saying. Was bring that crap here and watch the result. It's not gonna be the same as these big cities. That was his message. But of course people take it personal because in 2023, everyone takes everything personal. Yeah. I know people say this and I'm being very honest when I say this, I have literally been independent my entire life. So I've never carried the torch for the conservatives or the Democrats. No. But it is easy to see after all these years that the Democrat Party has lost its freaking mind. It has brainwashed people into some of the most nonsensical things ever. And that's what I expect out of this woman who warns. Warns. I want to hear what she has to say. I want to hear what they have to say about it. I don't care what she says. <laughs> Quite frankly, I could care less. I just want to hear what they have to say. Well, I'm curious of both. Let's do this. Got a show for y'all. Got a damn good show. I'm black. We <laughs> black. Yeah. But black people's got a problem. <laughs> no, that's, what, that's what I was trying Black to. people are delusional. No, it's like it's like they're living in a false sense of reality. Yeah, I, I mean, black people is crazy. I mean, it's something really wrong with them. Yeah, what I want to say is like they're delusional, <laughs> false sense of reality. The niggas are crazy. <laughs> what I want to say is hammer your point home. Cancel Get it, Kevin. In the black community, and it's what, that's sickle cell. <laughs> no, it's just mindset. It, it was a joke. It was a messed up joke, but yeah, okay, it's like it's just mindset that I. It's like a cancer, and it's metastasizes within our com community, the black community. I, I'm still, I know I'm black. Well, it's not a cancer. That's just us. That's just black people being black. They I, see things from uh, black people <laughs> see things different than a white man. Yeah, white but, man's got his way. Yeah, the niggas, <laughs> yeah, totally different way of looking at it. <laughs> Just look at it. Let's go back to the roots. Let's go back to the origin where white people came from and where uh, black people came from. I think that's look how. Shut up. <laughs> look how people living in Ireland, Scotland, right? He said Ireland. European, Wales, right? <laughs> now go down. Uh, 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 go to Sudan and look how them Sudan niggas. Sudan is the Sudan. <laughs> Sudan, uh, Sudan, one said, of those. You said like a white man. Go down there to the what? Sudan. <laughs> That's the white man that said it. It's the Sudan. Yeah, look how they Sudan. living. These uh, women, did you have women walk around with their titties out? Hey, Kevin, I didn't get Walk it. around with no, jugs they, of water on their head. <laughs> Ain't wearing no shirt. Niggas got plates in their lips. <laughs> I saw a dude's lip was hanging like this. It's hey, just a totally different. Uh, we just different. Hey man, you going too deep on this? It ain't even that deep. No man, it's different. Look at the uh, look at the um, the black Aboriginal from Australia. Walk around with bones around his neck, with white paint, looking straight crazy. Walk around in underwear. That's a fact, man. It's just we're different. You know why we think the way we think? Why? Cause you got that white man's blood in. <laughs> 
We be trying to tell black people to think a different way. They can't. <laughs> They, no, they don't man. have the white man's blood. <laughs> no, man, stop, man. No, I'm, 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 I'm no, spitting, I'm man, spitting no, facts over here. No, no, That's man. straight facts. No, man, no. It ain't that deep, Kevin. It <laughs> it's is culture. It's culture. Culture. Culture, right? Right. <laughs> to give y'all some context what we're talking about, I'm going to show you this video. And I think this woman embodies. I think she'll be a lot happier if she just moved to Africa. Hey man, I was getting ready to say some epic <laughs> shit, and you just huh. <laughs> oh, this girl needs to go to Sudan, <laughs> Sudan, man. walk around with her titties out, with bones <laughs> around her neck, <laughs> walk around with forty gallons of water in here. <laughs> <laughs> she will be so much happy just living in the jungle, walk around with spears and shit. Well, just want to just black. black, 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 black. I want to hear this black, woman that player. The typical mindset. I don't. I just want this. Black community. Yeah, ninety percent. <laughs> Cause you know the other ten percent, you know, lean right. They got that white blood in. Them. Got that white blood in them. <laughs> <laughs> hey, check this video out. Uh, I got a wild take for y'all. She look good though. I don't give a. F there, there you go. About the <laughs> white boy and his nook if you buck song, Jason Haldane. You too. <laughs> we know this for a fact because we already saw him take off running when somebody actually did pull one out and get the bussin'. What? I don't give a f that white boy. He's a distraction. Yeah, you do. That's why you talk. You know what I give a f about? I give a f about that white boy in the governor's mansion in Florida. Wow. I give a f about that white boy in the governor's mansion in Texas. Wow. I give a f about that scary ass white boy in the White House. She don't like no white people. <laughs> That's who I give a f about. She don't like no white people. Jason Aldean out here running scared. Them white boys are making laws. Laws running that scared. bind our ass and relegate us to the back of the bus. Man, you crazy as hell. <laughs> that white boy is a distraction. Jason Aldean is a distraction. He's making his money. <laughs> yes, yes, he is. Is. That's happening around us. It's election season. They always throw us some curveballs and y'all niggas still trying to catch them crazy man. just keep voting democrat that's the we gonna way. go fishing let's go for the big fish here we go because jason aldean ain't gonna do shit. ain't this a threat we all got a knuck if you buck song cars is better because well shit we black well, you ain't about shit. we're black black you ain't about shit. <laughs> <laughs> we What's must it? be black Feel pragmatic. She don't look black. She looks she mixed. Look, she we looks got mixed. a lot of ammo out here. We've been fighting this fight for a long time. I've been killing Stop you wasting your ammo on that busted ass white boy talking about nugget if you buck. Yeah, Save you that for the real white boys that's causing the real drama and pain and torture. Terror that sounds like a call to action. In our communities. Oh, that's black people. I see <laughs> what take on it. Because we can do both. We can roast that white boy. We can roast the of him. This is threats. And we can still go it after is. these white boys that's causing real harm in our communities. Who is that? What y'all want to do? <laughs> Just yeah. them in the background. <laughs> I'm gonna put all my energy in these white boys that's making They make videos like this, this tolerable for me because I can't stand this, this, any of this. What y'all want to do? That's just Let a dumbass. I just, ugh, I hate, I hate confrontation, y'all. Yeah, I think she'd be a whole lot better off. She, she said we need to be pragmatic. No yeah, problem. Black people already problem. No, I said, right. She said we need to be. She said we need to be more pragmatic, right? That means to be sensible. You was not sensible in that time. Man, you look crazy as hell. Yeah. Yeah. It came off like a threat. She keeps. Yeah. She don't like. No, she obviously she don't like uh, Republicans. She don't like Biden. Either. She don't like anybody who's white. She sounds like a racist. She's a huge racist. And yeah. that whole video came off. Like a threat. Well, she's talking about just I like had said that. Threatened black people. He didn't threaten nobody. He just said, he just gave y'all a, a caveat, a warning, a caution. Don't do this in a small town. <laughs> That's all he said. That's all he said. He giving y'all some damn good advice. You know what's funny? She segued from uh, from Al Dean, right? She ain't talking about none of the rap music. She's talking about killing other black people, calling women. B word, kill cops, none of that. She ain't bring none of that up. 
or just a white guy making up a country song, wanting people not to come to that city and, and do anything is crazy. Oh, that's a threat, but black rap music, this gangster rap, this real music, she ain't mentioned none of that. We call that what's your one of the blue scrubs? Scrubs? Scrubs. Yeah, I'm yeah, going to I I I I I right out. She's probably one of those that works in a nursing home and has to tend to white people and abuses them. Oh, God. That chick braids, braids, clean. Your complexion looks flawless. You are batshit crazy. You got an evil, dark spirit, man. That's why you don't judge a book by its cover. She's evil in his eyes. He has a lot of hate. But did you see the eyebrows? She offers a lot of ill will towards the people. Say, let's focus on the white people and perpetual surprise laws. Said, what laws are they yeah uh, what, what legislate and creating that certain black people what are you trying to focus on you didn't say anything about candidates you wanted to vote for or, or how you was going to combat the things you know the issues that you really liberals never laws provide laws they they what Come laws are they passing that's hurting black people yeah you act like they just uh that shit's going through the house and the, the house already voted it's in the senate let's bring back this slavery we're gonna chain these niggas up <laughs> What laws are they passing? Yeah. Man, so I tell you she's saying like nobody. Man, you know she's saying I ain't putting up with that shit. <laughs> nope. Listen you know, how Dean's a damn good white man. Damn good pink. He he living the American dream. Got a big old house. Got a got a lovely wife. Yeah. <laughs> Even Trump kissed her. <laughs> <laughs> that was that's that's like a if Trump kissed you, yeah, you yeah, you fine. Yeah, you Trump fine. ain't kissing unless you fine. Hey man, that giveaway is almost over. Yeah? We got what a couple days left. We got, got four, four days left. Damn, we can wear four wrapped in ten thousand dollars. They segue like Ben Shapiro. Right now, you get ten times the interest. You get ten times the interest. You spend a dollar, you get ten interest. <laughs> you spend a dollar, you get ten interest. You spend ten dollars, you get a hundred interest. Did you hear that? You spend a dollar, you get ten inch. You spend ten dollars, you get a hundred inch. And if you're right now, you end up both our giveaways, cause we give away a, 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 a what do you call it? One of them damn uh, Rams with the <laughs> with the twenty five hundred these with the Cummins and that. If you're right now, you end up to win both of those trucks. Yeah, you gotta Go get it. Gotta get it. Yeah, they right. They they hit the nail on the head. I ain't got nothing else to say. Yeah, I mean, you I can't love argue them. with Keith and Kevin. <laughs> I love them. They're on point. Yeah, I mean, that's just, they say it's reverse racism. It's just racism. And she's racist. Yeah. She absolutely hates and despises white people. She made that clear. She made it very <laughs> clear that she was perfect because she was black. Yeah. When in reality, she's brainwashed by liberal ideals. So my understanding of how this works is, back in the day, Hitler and people of that nature wanted a perfect white specimen. It had to be absolutely perfectly white blonde hair blue eyes blonde hair blue eyes no other ethnicity whatsoever they were the perfect white person except for him <laughs> anyway sorry not the point but if you had any other mixture of any other race it could be black asian it could be any other race and you were tainted latino you name it at that point you lose all your whiteness and to these white supremacists you are now black, or you were Mexican, or you were you know, you, whatever white you had does not matter anymore. It doesn't exist anymore. You are no longer pure. And that is the white supremacist belief. Mm -hmm. The reality is Keith and Kevin are biracial, mixed. Yeah. Most people are mixed. If you really dig deep, you're going to have something of everything, someone. Yep. There is no perfect white race. But to call her black, and her blackness and everything she had to say. She didn't look straight black. She's biracial. She's gotta be. And for people to say things like, you know, I'm black, Obama's black. You know, that's what white Sorry. supremacists think. So kudos to you. You agree with the white supremacist in that aspect. <laughs> Backfired. That's a burn about a burn. That's a second degree burn. Yeah, so you found common ground with white supremacists by assuming that you're black, even Good though job. you're definitely biracial with multiple different races. With the monobrows. That's just facts, guys. I didn't make it up. It's there for a reason. It's just reality, so take it for what it is. But if that is your belief, if you're mixed or you're biracial, and you assume yourself as only one of those identities, 
you agree with white supremacists because they think the same way you do. You ain't got no white in you. Just food for thought. Like, share, subscribe. Do the thing. Do the thing. And until the next time, guys, and always, come at me, bro. The bro down is over. Let's bro out. <laughs>